hi guys i hope you are doing great in this video i will be potting my hibiscus and geranium plants that i showed you when i got all those plants on sale so before i repot them this part is for the hibiscus it might look a little small and this part is for this geranium it might look a little small too but geraniums and hibiscus prefer their roots to be tight right therefore when you take your geraniums and hibiscus home from the store the suggestion is to plant them in pots that are just about one size up from the pots that they arrive in the thing is if you put them in a bigger pot and the roots are spread out they won't perform as much they won't bloom as much when the roots are closer together then they will perform better and you will get more blooms now if the roots are too tight you will know because they won't perform as well either and then you'll know it's time to go a pot size up from the one you have them in so i'm gonna go ahead and start potting that's just about right because i won't be putting any soil on the top here just around the sides and so it's sitting pretty close to the top but not too close so that's good usually when i'm um, repotting something i will trouble the roots right so i can loosen them so they don't get root bound however because hibiscus and geraniums like um a bit of a root bound situation i'm now gonna trouble this i'm just gonna go ahead put this in here and then put soil around it and i'll do the same for the geraniums So as you can see guys, I am done potting the plants. I've taken them into the greenhouse and I'm going to let them stay in here for the night. Then tomorrow I'll clean up the pots a bit more and take them inside. Thank you so much for watching the video guys. Thank you so much for subscribing. Please leave a comment below and let me know about your geraniums and hibiscus do you have a hibiscus what color hibiscus do you have i grew up back home in jamaica with mostly red hibiscus there was one that just had green leaves like this one and then there was one that had like a variegated green and white leaf and believe me um north of 50 and that plant is still there whenever i go home to visit they're very hardy tropical plants it's just a bit more difficult to take care of them indoors <laughs> anyways guys yeah if you have watched my videos before or even if this is the first time you're watching the video please go ahead man and hit that subscription button also remember to hit the notification bell icon so you can be notified of new videos. You take care now. 
and I'll see you in the next video.